Hey, it's Charles Guidat here. Now, I get a number of questions from successful business owners who are looking to improve their sales process. So in today's quick video, I wanna walk you through our process and how it's worked to increase our client sales by as much as double, and to do so without spending more money, more and more effort to bring in more leads. Now, I originally got this idea for this process by studying under Dr. W. Edwards Deming's apprentice. And then eventually I had a client who was Dr. Deming's business partner. And if you don't know who Deming is, he's the guy who's credited as creating one of the world's most significant turning points in world history, as well as personally adding billions of dollars in process improvement. I mean, this guy added more revenue improvement than any other person that I'm aware of throughout history. And he did this by simply having a system in place for continuous improvement and by figuring out problems through a higher level of consistency and understanding what a successful result means within context. So the first step to accomplish this is to plan. Ever see a six-year-old playing soccer? I mean, they're all chasing each other in one group, all trying to get the ball to the goal. They're disorganized and they're haphazard. And that's a sales team without a playbook. So then step one is that your sales team must have a playbook, a playbook to grow the pipeline and to close sales. Now, this is a step-by-step -step outline of the steps that they need to take and when they need to take it and the goal that they're all trying to achieve. You see, the right playbook has no guesswork. It's completely intentional. And then each sales rep has a consistent process to follow. So then step two is to do. Now your sales team is executing the plan and as they execute each plan, they're tracking all their action steps in the pipeline, measuring the success and the conversion of each step in the process. And we do this because of instead of completely overhauling the entire sales playbook when you wanna make a change, you can figure out what part of the plan is working and what part needs improvement. So first you plan and then you do. And then now step three, you study. Look at the results. Did your outcome match your goal? What's working? What's not working? Why did it work? And then you make improvements to the playbook. And then finally step four, act. Now that you've learned what's working and what's not, you gotta test the impact of your improvements to compare it against the original results. And by going through this process ourselves, we've reduced no-shows from 50% to 28%. We just helped a sales team have their best month in history by showing them where they wasted 50% of their time by identifying leads that have an 85% chance of not converting. This way they could just spend more time on leads that do convert. And we just helped another company find 1.35 million in extra revenue by simply fixing a leak in their follow-up process. You see, I tell you this because constant improvement is a mindset, a mindset where you're always looking for ways to make better decisions and get more out of everything you're already doing so that you have a more efficient and a more effective company. Remember, plan, do, study, and act. This is Charles Gaudet. I'll see you in another video.